Okay, Timmy Crowley up bottom of the third. Bring it out, Zach. Leading 3-0. I thought it was going to be a blowout for a while there. Come on, Timmy, get a hold of one. Yes, he did want that one. Can I get a hold of one here? I can feel it. Timmy Crowley put one to the fence. Ooh. The sound of the freight train off into the distance down here on Lewis Street in Jackson, Michigan. Oh, and he gets hit. Come on, Bubba, quit hitting our guys. Somebody's whistling. Uh, looks like we got a. Might be showing bunt here. He's gonna. No. Let's see here. <laughs> Jake, he does that little lean back thing. It looks like he's going to tip over. In the dirt. Oh, there he goes. Good job, Timmy. Way to pay attention. Pitcher, or the catcher bobbled it a little, just enough to get him down to second. In the dirt. Timmy's looking. Timmy's looking. He's watching. He's looking. Jakey. Uh-oh, we got time. Okay, so back to the John Cool pitching story. Man, how many years ago was it? I don't know. A long time ago. And uh, let's get let's zoom on that amazing guy for work on it. And he would pitch the ball and it would go out there and the guy would hit it. And if it was a ground ball up the middle or in the vicinity, he would sometimes get in the way. Just, I don't know how he did it, but he would get in the way. He wouldn't feel the ball. He wouldn't even bend over. He was, I don't know what he was doing. But we had a guy on our team that when he did this, he let him have it. Norm Van Wagner was his name. Norm was a great shortstop and he would tell John Cool, my father-in-law and he said it in such a way that I, I wish I could have filmed it and had had it play but he would say hey if you're not he would say if you're not going to field the ball get out of the way don't get in my way and I can't make a play <laughs> uh, it was so funny. You had to be there, but it was, I know my father-in-law is probably laughing right now watching this, but everybody else who's listening to this stupid story is probably glad it's over with, but next time you see <laughs> the oldest guy at the baseball games, it's probably John Cool. He wears his Notre Dame hat all the time you got to go ask him about norm <laughs> okay i'm done story's over